Hey, what's up guys? So you have a Fitbit uh, Versa or a Fitbit Sense and you can't like connect or pair to your phone here. Every time you try, try it, it says uh, something went wrong, connection with the device timed out. So I'm going to get you guys up and running. We're going to give you several solutions, okay? So the first thing what we're going to do is we're going to do this. Now go to your um, go to your connections, okay? And then what you want to do is put it in airplane mode. So put it in airplane mode, wait three seconds and then turn it off, okay? Now, let's go back, let's abort this, and let's go back to the uh, Fitbit app here. Let's tap on set up device, and then go ahead and tap if you have one of the verses or the sense, I'm using a sense here. Let me tap on sense, and let's do set up here, and then let's scroll up. Now I can tap on accept here. It says let it charge. So I'm gonna grab the charger here, I'm gonna go ahead and Make sure that it's on there, make sure it's charging, and then I'm going to click on next here. Now it says searching. Let's see what happens here. I'm hoping that we still get that error so I can go on to the other ones. So it says sense found, and now it says connecting to tracker. So let's see what happens here. So it's been a couple of minutes, it's still saying connecting to tracker, and it says sense found, so I'm still on the same page. Okay, so after a couple minutes, I get the same message here again. Something went wrong. Okay, perfect. Now we're going to do something else. What we're going to do is go ahead and restart your phone. So restart or uh, just turn it off and turn it, turn it back on. So let me go ahead and turn my phone off. And then I'm going to go ahead and turn it back on. So turn the phone back on. So as you're waiting for your phone to turn back on, go ahead and grab your uh, Fitbit here. And what I want you to do is just press here on the sides. Just press and hold it and don't let go. We're gonna force it to restart, okay? So ready, one, two, three. I'm gonna press and hold. I just felt it vibrate. Now I'm still holding here. I'm not gonna let go. I'm still holding, still holding. I'm just waiting for it to restart or basically went until I see the uh, Fitbit logo. I'm still holding on here on the sides. I just felt it vibrate again. Hoping that I get a Fitbit logo. There it is. Go ahead and let this go. And then wait until my watch and my phone boot up. Okay, so they both booted up now. Now let's go back into your Fitbit app. And then same thing, top left hand side, click on that avatar photo right there. And then you wanna go down to set up a device. And again, mine is a sense here. You gotta find which, which Fitbit you have. We're gonna tap on set up here. We're just gonna scroll down so we can accept this right here. And then I'll go ahead and pack, go back and let it charge. So make sure that's on. Then it's charging. Let's go ahead and tap on next here. It's searching again. Let's see what happens here. Okay, so we're on this page again. Sense found, connected to tracker, and let's see what happens here. Okay, so after two minutes of waiting for it connected to tracker, I get this message here again. Something went wrong. Let's go ahead and abort this. And now that's what I want you to do. Go ahead and close the Fitbit app completely. I mean, this is an iPhone. You just scroll up. And you swipe up. If you have an Android phone, you want to tap on the three um, vertical lines on the bottom, usually on the bottom left hand side, the Recents app. Tap on that and just swipe up to close the Fitbit app. Okay, so the Fitbit app is closed now. Now just go into your uh, connections, your uh, Bluetooth connections. So here's my Bluetooth here. Let me tap on that. Now what I'm going to do is tap it off, then tap it on, tap it off, tap it on. And then tap it off one more time and then tap it back on and now now we're going to go to back to the Fitbit app let's open it back up now and same thing click on the avatar photo right there go back to set up a device and then pick your Fitbit watch mine's the sensor again we're going to tap on setup here scroll all the way up tap on accept it's charging already I'm going to tap on next here now it says searching again now it's connecting to tracker and we'll see if uh, what happens with this way. Okay, what do you know? It worked. 30 by four digit code. Yours is gonna be different obviously, but there you go. I just troubleshoot it and those are all the steps I had anyway. So I'm glad that last one worked. So any, uh, if it worked for you, give me a thumbs up. If it didn't, give me a thumbs down, right? Good luck.